Hi there, it's Julie Kinnear of the Julie Kinnear team with Keller Williams Co Elevation Realty, and I'm standing right in front of 321 Ontario Street. We are here in uh, Cabbage Town, and such an incredible location. You're in this quiet pocket of beautiful Victorian homes, and then uh, you know you're hop, skip, and a jump from downtown. You can literally walk to uh, the Financial District, Eaton Centre, Entertainment District. Uh, you know, you've got great paths for biking and hiking and you've got the Riverdale Farm and of course Cabbage Town is famous for one of the things is, is how the pride of ownership and um, how people have, you know, transformed some of these Victorians and of course their uh, art and garden tours. So, uh, you know, you really got it here. This is, this is such a beautiful combination of original uh, Victorian character. This is, home was built about 130 years ago. You got the nice soaring ceilings, the um, crown moldings, the ceiling, ceiling medallions, but then you got this incredible, you know, you know, high-end fixtures, light fixtures, very modern, really beautiful windows. Those are Norwood wood windows. Look at the millwork uh, throughout. This house is in pristine, immaculate condition, has been renovated and absolutely gorgeous throughout. And of course it's Wonderful for entertaining, nice big dining room, uh, living room area, and uh, you know, you can ha throw a big party here. It's got the must-have uh, main floor powder room, uh, very stylish, and uh, of course it's kitchen party uh, central here. Beautiful, gorgeous, uh, upgraded, renovated kitchen, and they just put in actually this, um, this millwork and TV and um, electric fireplace and the fireplace actually has a heating system thermostat in it so it actually adds uh, heat in the winter you've got the induction cooktop this beautiful cold steel um, rolled you know attached table tons of cabinetry built-in um, appliances built-in you know stove and, and micro and all that kind of stuff it's nice to have these like very high-end uh, finishings and of course recessed lighting and one of the highlights is the fact that this whole back area is so uniquely renovated and uh, the whole house just really oozes light and quality and class and uh, you walk out the back door here and you've got this beautiful serene backyard very low maintenance uh, and private parking for two you know again entertain entertainers dream back here for sure uh, and amazing that you have this sort of private and secure parking and you literally walk into the home and from top to bottom it's uh, you know it's just relax and enjoy and uh, get away from it all. I'm gonna do a video of the um, second third and lower level be sure to check that out how great is these phantom screens it's such a nice combo they've you know the the way it's been upgraded and uh, taken care of and it's ready for you. I'm standing on the second level of 321 Ontario Street. This is the spectacular Victorian that has been remodeled and is such an incredible com combination of, of old and new, of a Victorian sort of style, and then a real modern aesthetic that I think you will fall in love with. And I love some of the uh, incredible work that they've done. It's just, it's serene, it's peaceful. We're in the master bedroom here. And you can see there's just so much natural light coming through. There's actually seven skylights. Uh, look at this cathedral ceiling. Uh, super spectacular when you wake up. And of course, I love how they retain the stained glass window there at the top, sort of peeking out. And then these gorgeous uh, bay window, Norwood wood uh, windows that have been installed and this spectacular floor. Uh, and uh, really well laid out. They've got a full walk-in closet, so that's is a kind of a must-have. How beautiful is this? And each closet has ha has these custom closet organizers and organizers throughout. You can feel even the weight of the doors, very high-end, solid. Uh, these have double doors, so you can see that you can walk through both this uh, bedroom and the second bedroom over here have the double doors, so you've got this incredible sort of open feeling again open up to the loft area that's the third bedroom up there great use of space really sort of light and bright and very luxurious feeling as you the, you know walk down into this sunken second bedroom it's got a second uh you know big 
closet organizers again, very hard, solid doors, plenty of natural light coming through. Of course, these people use it as a sort of den, you know, second living room, family room. You can easily have it as a second bedroom. And then uh, there's all this light coming, streaming through from the backyard and that big, huge private yard. Uh, and uh, how great would this be sort of to work from home option and uh, you know it's got this beautiful railing and you can oversee sort of the French doors. Really beautiful use of space, uh, real sense of sort of home, very cozy, very secluded. Uh, I didn't forget the bathroom which has also been completely gutted and redone in 2016 and again really high finishings. The light fixtures, the faucets, the you know the quartz bench you know, the waterworks, uh, you know, bathroom uh, fixtures, faucets, that sort of thing. It's, uh, it's serene and it's spectacular. Nice tempered glass. And I'm going to sneak you up to the third floor here. Uh, again, really multi-purpose uses, depending on what your family needs, whether you want a guest space, uh, whether you've got kids visiting, whether you've got family visiting, what have you, if you want to work from home. Uh, again, the mechanics here are spectacular as well. There's a ductless air conditioner. It was brand new in 2021. The, the hot water gas uh, system is also, sorry, the forced air gas uh, furnace is also new in 2020. Uh, you know, and, and as they say, nice big open space here and lots of natural light throughout. Uh, I'm gonna, you, of course you could close off this area up here if you wanted to, or you can um, keep it all open. You can have it maybe as an art space, you can have it as a playroom, you know, you, you can have it as a music room, lots of different options. And I'm just going to, you probably saw the video on the main level, I'm not going to repeat it all, but I did want to sort of take you down into uh, the lower level, the basement here, where the mechanics are. So it's a mostly unfinished basement, you know, lots of usable space on the se main second and third. Uh, but it's also nice to have storage. It's nice to have all your mechanics, your laundry, all that kind of stuff. You can see it's been interior waterproofed. It's got big uh, front loader, washer, dryer. There's that forced air gas carrier furnace from last year. Hot water, uh, you know, tank. And again, it is convenient to have some extra storage for everybody. And uh, here you go. Or if you wanted to refinish it, the world is your oyster. So be sure to check out the other video.